Hey y'all, what up Steven Scoots people? Alright, welcome YouTube, welcome to my channel. I am Steven Scoots and today we will be talking about everything that happened when we went to meet Scooter Brad, CY Trash Willy, freaking uh, the vault, just everything. So I got off work, went over there immediately right after, it was like a what, 20, 30 minute drive. I just like try to like rush through traffic as fast as possible. I was with Austin and we got there. There were over like 95 kids, well, well over 95 kids. There were quite a bit. It was like the whole entire skate park was packed. If you were a skateboarder, rollerblader, BMX rider, or a super, super tiny kid that didn't even know about the skate park, it was not the day for you. There were so many scooter kids there that every single other person that wanted to ride, they were not able to ride at all. They kept getting mad because there were so many scooter riders, but at the same time, there's a famous person in town, never could see them, so you get what I mean. But we went over there, hung out, uh, we got there, I got out of the car, started putting my GoPro on, I grabbed my phone, put it in its mount, and I'll take my scooter and stuff. And I already had Gabriel, which he has been in my vlogs before, he came and said what's up, and then for a joke he was like, Scooter Brad is here! He screamed it out. There were like 50 kids ran straight over to my car and it was just nuts. I never got ambushed by like a ton of people before. Ambushed by a, t by a ton of people before. So it was a little different experience for me, but it was really, really, really cool at the same time. And I don't know why, but last year I parked at this kind of like the same spot where I knew the, the other people would park as well, like the vault from last year came. And Scooter Brad and them all parked next to my car again, so it was awesome. So if you see like a gold like Hyundai in their edits and stuff, that's my car. But for right now. But for right now, um, yeah, I got there, they all ambushed me, and I was like, they'll be here soon, because I knew they were already stuck in traffic. I already checked the freeways and stuff. It was so packed with traffic, that's why I didn't go that way. I took the side streets, got me there quicker, but you know. They didn't know that I didn't have no contact way to talk to them, to tell them not to take that way. But they got there just a little bit late. But uh, the moment they got there, there you can see in the previous vlog, all the kids ran to them straight. And then I was like, oh, they're here. So I grabbed my stuff and I ran over there, started filming. Um, they, they were like filming, saying what's up. There were just so many kids there. And then they were like talking with them for a good like five, 10 minutes. Then we all went to the skate park. Scooter Brad was literally busy for almost two hours taking photos, signing signatures, saying hi to people, threw a little bit of like merch away with the Vault Pro Scooters at the beginning. Um, but Scooter Brad was busy for a little while and after he was done with that, he went to go ride and with his GoPro and film a little bit, which was awesome. Got to see him, got to ride with him, got to take a photo with him. He's a pretty cool dude Be besides, you know, how everybody sees him on the camera and he talks and whatnot. In person, he's actually a pretty cool dude. Um, I got to ride with him just the tiniest bit. I got to say what's up, you know, have the tiniest conversation, but nothing too crazy. Uh, I didn't get to have like a one-on-one -on -one conversation because there was always fans. All the fans were there and they were just having fun riding, getting his, talking to him and everything. So, um, in the future, it would be nice to, you know, hang out with Scooter Brad and uh, talk to him and ride with him and, you know, just have a jolly old time. But, um, I had, he's a pretty cool dude. Since like you know you don't see him on the can be behind like you know a computer screen or an iPhone screen. Um, he's a pretty cool dude. Uh, White Trash was there. He remembers me. I had my friend Sam FaceTime me to say hi to him. Watch. I think I'm in one of their videos. I did like a mega spin and a tornado. Uh, did the mega spin a little, not not so clean, but it was super super fun. I got to ride with everybody. I got to sign helmets. Got to sign like people's skin because they wanted their skin signed. Because a lot of people had their like forehead signs, so I was like, cool. Uh, I gave away like scooter stands, stickers, bracelets, and um, what else? Wheels I threw out. Um, all scooter back threw out like shirts. What else? They gave away like two through scooters I heard of. Uh, I didn't get to film it because they gave it away like to like certain kids or something like that. So I didn't get to film that. I wasn't aware of it. But besides that, uh, we all threw like stickers and shirts and bracelets in the in the big old bowl that we had. I don't even know how big it was. Like, it looked like an 18 footer, but I don't even know. It's called the Death Bowl. It's super big, very inverted, but 
but it was super crazy. It was super fun. And I know I will link my vlog to that whole entire, everything that happened in there. It's all, I didn't, the only thing I edited was like certain parts, but I pretty much made everything raw. So you guys get to experience what I got to experience filming wise. I know like I will make a little edit besides it, but at the same time, I wanted to incorporate the raw footage that I got to see while I was there. Um, I mean, there's just, there's like a full 24 minute video. It's very, very long. They were there for about three hours. Um, I didn't get to answer a couple questions that a couple people wanted to, um, wanted me to ask him, uh, because we wanted to ask him because he was so freaking busy every single second. I couldn't like talk with him that much at all. Like he was like right after filming it, filming right after talking and taking photos and everything he went to go film so while he was filming why don't you say hey Steven why don't you go you know talk with him I tried but he was busy filming and getting clips so I was like not trying to bother him so much because he was you know for his vlog he was very intended to uh, go you know sign signatures and everything give away prizes and ride a little bit to have some fun he really liked the skate park of what I seen so which was pretty good he liked vegas i hope uh in the future i could possibly fly him out here or he will come out here again maybe next year for inner bike or something I'm not sure uh but shout out to fusion for having everybody else come out here and for having just the whole ride day a meetup um some parents were um a little angry it wasn't organized because it was like a meetup it was just like he's gonna come here you know, sign some stuff, meet the fans, ride a little bit, you know, hang out. It wasn't as planned as, you know, some other people would think it would be, but it was just like a really cool like way to like see him really quick before he goes back to, uh, I think it was New Zealand. So, which is, it's pretty cool. He got to like come out here and hang out. He was out here for about two or three days. Black Church really came like a day ago, so it's cool to see him. I haven't seen him about six months. Uh, Raymond Brim Warner, uh, Dakota was just out here like two, three years ago, but now he's in, uh, Australia with Raymond and, uh, Clayton and stuff. They're all chilling out there for a competition. Uh, it would be cool if they came out here, but, you know, they had to go across the road to have fun, so that's awesome too. Um, so pretty much that's what I have for the video. I filmed, I tried riding, uh, quite a bit, uh, kind of succeeded at that, kind of didn't. I mean, I turned out like... The most I put the camera down was for like 50 minutes so I could just have a sesh. Uh, for like 80% of the time I was holding a camera or I had my GoPro on. But I really didn't, I filmed a couple things with my GoPro but I was like I'm not even going to put that in there. It's not even worth it. So I just put everything that I filmed off my phone uh, into the whole entire vlog that I posted. Uh, I hope you guys did enjoy that. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you guys did, please smash that thumbs up button. If you're new, subscribe if you like the video. And also, there's I have like a ton more videos. Go check it out right down below. And also, if you guys want to share this so other people get to hear what I experienced, kind of what the, the behind the camera and whatnot in person. Yeah. So that's pretty much what I have for today. So uh, yeah, I'm going to film another video uh, today, and then I'm gonna go edit like a ton of things. So, oh, and also really quick, uh, I'm I'm trying to figure out because I know I need merch. I need merch. I need merch. I know you guys are asking me about it uh, all over my social media. Not so much over YouTube, but like over like Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook stuff. Uh, I'm trying my very, 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 very best to get it. It's very, very difficult right now because I'm trying to find like a certain person for shirts, uh, for stickers and bracelets. They will be coming super soon. Next couple weeks, I'm trying to find a certain design that I want on it. And the colorway and stuff so I'm gonna figure that out then the moment I get it I swear I will tell you guys and uh, probably open something to ship it to you guys and also uh, when I when I have them I go to skate parks if you want to ask me for stickers or bracelets go for it but uh, don't ask me yet because I don't have any but uh, eventually I will have some but uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video hope you guys are having an awesome and great day thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you all tomorrow. And you know how it is. Peace out and roll the outro.